imagine an Africa that is strong. Imagine an Africa that is kind, an Africa whose streets are paved with gold. Imagine an Africa that is led by wise men and women like Imhotep and Pesifet, who put listening at the center of their leadership, just as it was done in the Mbongis of Congo. At the Mbongi, leaders focused their attention on understanding the plight of the people. And they go to work to solve the problems of the people. Imagine with me an Africa that stands toe to toe with any continent or country because her leaders are full of integrity. Imagine an Africa in which her people, when they travel, are greeted with warm welcome because they are the salt of the earth. They elevate our common human experience wherever they go. They are peacemakers who are seen as the protectors of humanity. That Africa once existed, that Africa was interrupted, and it is up to us to recreate that Africa. Can you imagine an Africa where business is conducted with ease because people love and trust each other? An Africa where strangers can travel long distances at night without fear. Strangers are welcome and offered a cup of tea, a meal, and a bed if they were stranded. That Africa is possible. We can create it. Imagine with me an Africa that sends her people around the world to learn so they can return to improve the conditions of Africans. Imagine an Africa where others come to study the African way, the way of humans. That Africa is possible. Africa can rise from the ashes only if we roll up our sleeves and build it. It is time for us to rebuild Africa.